good morning y'all welcome back it has been a minute since i made a video i have just been living the craziest life right now i started working as a substitute teacher and that has kind of taken up most of my time school has been insane which i kind of want to like touch up on that a little bit a little later um but yeah welcome if you're new here my name is carolyn i'm uh, MSW social work graduate student and if you are getting your master's in social work or are a graduate student undergrad student I make like a lot of um, videos that might benefit you and your college journey because I have been through undergrad and I make a lot of videos that kind of help you with that so if you're new here please don't forget to subscribe stick around for more content that is about college because this is literally in my life right now and it's been a little crazy so i'm gonna go ahead and touch up on that a little bit the two courses that i'm taking are social work practice with latino population and macro assessment advanced macro assessment so um i really enjoy my classes but they are so much work the last two classes that i had were social work with diverse populations and I ended up getting two A's in my last courses which is just like unbelievable because there is like there was a certain point where I really thought I was gonna get B's in both of them I, I was just it was so difficult those classes that and I'm just so thankful that I was, I was able to like push through it and secured the A so 4.0 we are still up there <laughs> oh yeah these courses are a lot of work they're super like assignment intense bunch of reading i don't think it's nearly as much reading as my previous two courses but it is up there which i don't mind i actually like have one of my textbooks here for my latino populations course sorry that was rudy but yeah i've just been extremely busy with life and i haven't had a chance to film as much to film as much as I want to but I'm gonna get back on track and hopefully have some more videos coming your way so again if you're new here don't forget to subscribe to look forward to any of my future like school related videos or vlogs because I kind of like to vlog like my little everyday life sometimes too that's not around school work so yeah Also, H-E-B is like the only grocery store that I shop at for groceries. Sometimes if I need like a random thing, I'll go to like Walmart or Target, depending on like where I'm at. But if I buy like a good little amount of groceries, I always go to H-E-B. If you're a Texan, you know H-E-B is where it's at. I'm driving in the Wendy's drive-thru and look at this little family of ducks. Oh, they are so cute. Here's my little H-E-B haul. Um, I didn't buy that many things since I have a lot already here at home. So it was just like a few little random ingredients that I was missing. So um, just a little overview. I got Cheerios for my breakfast in the morning. Um, this huge 32 count of Tim Hortons coffee. I thought I would just buy this big one because I'm always running out of like the 12 count smaller pack really quickly. I got these uh, granola bars. I eat these as like a little dessert after I'm done eating my lunch. I got some balsamic vinaigrette, um, chickpeas, strawberries, grape tomatoes, celery, and just some chicken breasts. So yeah, this is my little H-E-B haul. because I do work Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday of next week. Today is Saturday, and I just won't have enough time to do it during the week. 
yeah, I'm trying to get as much of my homework done this weekend so I can be ready for the week and just work and maybe do like assignments that are a little shorter, don't take as much time. So that's kind of the plan for today and tomorrow. I took a nap like a 30 minute nap maybe um, I was pretty tired I made my second coffee of the day because caffeine is an essential in grad school so I literally cannot get anything done without having a coffee or a Celsius or something because my brain cannot work all day long consecutively so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the assignment that I'm working on right now. So it shouldn't take me too much time, but this is for my advanced macro assessment course. Um, it's a really small written assignment. It's only 200 to 250 words. And then I have this article that is gonna help me answer the couple of questions. So the article is 26 pages. I'm not sure if I necessarily am going to read the entire thing or skim over um, the parts that would be beneficial to answering this. So I'm going to go ahead and work on this. It is 2.20 right now. So still pretty early in the day. I have a good amount of time to get this done. And then afterwards, I have one more assignment for the same course where I'm going to choose an article that I'm going to write a journal about for next week. So we have to turn in like our article of choice and get it like approved. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. And I'll see if I have anything else that I'm doing besides homework today. Hopefully I do. Maybe tonight. We'll see. One of the best feelings in the world, submitting your assignment and getting the little notification. So I just finished this assignment. It was so quick. It was basically like a discussion, um, discussion board, but in the form of a Word document. So really easy. Done with that. Taking Rudy to the groomers because he needs a shower, right bud? <laughs> Stinky boy. He's camera shy. <laughs> <laughs> that I want to get for a bola, my boyfriend, but like that's his nickname, so I don't know if I should be getting like a B or an E for his real name, <laughs> I just think it's silly, but then again, it's like nobody knows him as his real name, so I'm like, okay, B, bola, oh, that's so cute, yeah, but it's like more, it's several, of them. but yeah, it has that exact same little orange. I did it. I have dark hair. I dyed it yesterday. Okay, so I have a little explaining to you. I was filming last week, so last Saturday was the clip that you just saw. And then Sunday was just like really hectic and I just didn't have the opportunity to vlog and I hate that I didn't, but we're back and it's the next weekend, so this is actually like the Saturday afterwards today is march 26th and i got my hair done yesterday i didn't end up doing it myself i went to go get it done i was just so afraid that i would leave like streaks of or like patches of blonde where i'd like miss so i was like you know what just go get it done somewhere so that it looks good and i did it i have black hair i freaking love it she did an amazing job i mean granted it wasn't anything like complicated but 
this is it and i love it so much um i think eventually once it grows out like a little longer i'm gonna go ahead and like cut it in like layers because right now it's just all one length but I'm going to be like messing with it like all the time now, but yeah, so basically today is Saturday. I went to breakfast with my parents and then I went to the farmer's market with my mom, super fun, and now I have to get to doing homework because I have a discussion due for my Latino populations course tonight and I need to get that done, obviously, so yeah. It's just so weird to like look at myself with dark hair and I've never dyed it black So this is like a first my natural hair is really dark like it literally almost looks black, but I've never had Black hair like this is this is dark. This is awesome. Like yeah, this is Black like I asked her dye it black not dark brown like my natural hair. So Yes, this I'm loving it. Anyways, um so yeah, I'm going to work on that assignment and then I'm probably going to hang out with my boyfriend today since it's the weekend. We just like to chill. We're going to a movie tonight. We're going to go watch X, that new A24 movie. I've heard mixed things, but mostly good things. I don't know. We'll see. One of my favorite YouTubers, Sarah Hawkinson, she has a horror channel, so it's called Possessed by Horror. And she just reviews like horror movies, horror books, and has fantastic and i haven't watched her review just because i want to go into the movie like completely unbiased opinion from like someone else kind of like in the back of my mind so yeah i'm pretty excited that's what we're gonna do tonight it's gonna be really chill chill day it's already one o'clock so yeah i'm probably gonna go get a coffee or something to give me some energy while i do some homework so yeah i have a discussion for my latino populations course i have to this really short assignment for my macro assessment course which is just like a part one to the part two paper so part one is basically like giving a little like um summary of this organization that we're going to be using as our um that we're going to be like analyzing for a project so that shouldn't be too bad and i believe that is it so it's going to be a pretty chill saturday tomorrow it's going to be crazy because i have to write a five page paper before monday before tuesday because tuesday we are going to vegas so i'm trying to get all my homework done this weekend so yeah i will see you guys later I ordered a Deftones t-shirt because we're seeing them in less than two months so the concert's May 3rd and I ordered a t-shirt just because I don't have any Deftones merch so they came in and got delivered I'm gonna go ahead and go pick it up right now okay so sorry about the angle this probably sucks <laughs> but um I thought I would open it that's better. Okay, you can see me now. Let's see the shirt. So small. I thought I would get just one that was just like with the members and not an album just because I don't know. But yeah, I just prefer to just have one with like all of them and Chino in the front, of course, and this one also has Chi which is um, the bassist that passed away like 10 years ago. But yeah, I really like this picture, this shirt, perfect for the concert. And now I'm headed to Domino's. So we had to come back home to get my book because I forgot it and I can't do my homework without it. And I stopped for a matcha latte with oat milk at Sovereign because I was falling asleep and I needed the caffeine boost, so.
was really struggling with this discussion, but I found exactly what I needed. Like right at the end after I had written something else that was just kind of like not, I guess, backed up by like a source. It was just kind of like what the common knowledge, but I finished it. And so I am done with my homework for the day. Thank goodness, because I'm tired and it's Saturday and I don't want to do homework. Bala is making popcorn. We decided to just stay home because my stomach's hurting, so. Yep. 